Na we o o o we o mi o mi we we o. Okay. Hello. Thank you so much for clicking on my video. So I'm literally uploading a haul on my channel right now. Like I'm looking at my screen, processing the video, and I just got another package. I don't think it can really fit in frame, but but I have my Neokio order. And this is like, this is a pretty big Neokio order for me. I think it's like 60 individual like cards or 60 individual like orders I placed, which, you know, it's much. <laughs> I balled out a little bit on this one. It's gonna be a little much, but I'm gonna take my name off of everything and then start showing you the cards. So yeah, I'll be back in a second. Everything has been freed of its packaging. It's all sitting to this side of me. It is quite a bit. Um, I'm very excited about all of it, but before I like start showing things, there's gonna be quite a few things in here that I have not given any explanation for. I've literally never talked about them, rarely on like Instagram and even my Twitter. So. Um, heads up there, gonna be some surprises, but isn't that fun? There's a few groups and a few idols that I've been considering collecting that are in here, but yeah, I will get to that when we get to that. I'm first gonna open all the stuff that doesn't have top loaders. Um, I usually group it, like organize it by group, but I'm just was too lazy to do that. So I'll just go through all the stuff that doesn't have top loaders first. So for starters, we have this. Um, I decided to collect some of Jonghyun's pre-order benefits. Neither of these are Jonghyun's pre-order benefits. <laughs> yeah, I just uh, thought that this was a pre-order benefit and I don't think it is, but that's okay. I have a little page in my twice binder for like random Jonghyun stuff um, because she's my bias in twice. So yeah, I don't really know what these cards are. Like I said, I thought they were pre-order benefits, but they're really cute. I really like them. She's like, adorable i have these and it also came with this button that i want to free yeah this cutie little jonghyun button is it can i put this on my little bag okay then i have singyun's fan club cards which i'm so excited about these i okay i'm listening <laughs> literally guess what i'm listening to right now one guess one single guess yeah 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 get into it <laughs> I ulted him so fast, like faster than anyone ever, but here are his fan club cards. They are just the cutest. I love him so much. Yeah, um, he's having a comeback. Please listen to it. He has yet to release a song that isn't um, flawless and I love him. And yeah, <laughs> I don't see a lot of people like standing or collecting soloists that much. And I will say it is a different experience than collecting a group. I don't know why, but it is, but I enjoy it because his stuff is all super cute and I'm in love with him. So yeah, those are Sogeen's fan club cards. And then I have these two Bim Bim and Jackson cards. They were just kind of floating in between a piece of cardboard that was like disintegrating. So I just opened these, but. But yeah, these are some of the last cards I needed for Call My Name. I think I'm, no. I'm still missing one Bam Bam Call My Name card, but otherwise I'm done. And the rest of the cards will be in this video too. So some got seven. And then this is from Ghost9. I'm completing my, completing my OT9 Ghost9 collection in this video. So this is Kang Sung's wall set. Um, yep. Love this card, love this card. His cards are so cute. Yeah, I'm a little unsure what I'm gonna do with my Ghost9 collection moving forward. If I'm gonna collect OT7 now that two of the members left or go back to just collecting my top three, unsure. But I have gonna keep my OT9 collection up till now. So these are Yosung's oh, Dreamers cards. So this is a Tower Records card. And then these are the three album cards. So these are the two like regular version or these are the two regular version and this is the like 18 version card. So yeah, and then I also have this Tower Records card, which I didn't know what was in here. Most of this stuff I got a really long time ago. So I don't fully remember everything <laughs> or why I bought some of these things, but that's okay. It's a surprise for you and me. <laughs> these fit in here. 
Oh, they will. These are like the exact same size as the Mad cards from GOT7. Why did they do this? Why are they so big? I wasn't gonna collect Japanese cards because I don't collect Japanese cards for ATs, but I really liked this song and I thought the cards were really pretty and I found some good sets like this bad boy. <laughs> so yeah, I'm collecting both of my biases for this, question mark, but these are the two regular versions for, uh, you know? <laughs> cool, those are some ATs cards. And then I decided to collect Jonghyun's pre-order benefits. So this is some of those. Can I open this? <laughs> okay. Okay, so I'm not gonna be sleeving all of these because some of these aren't gonna go in the collection, but, or most of them are. Okay, let's go through them. So this is her Yes or Yes pre-order benefit set. I just like was looking at these cards and I really liked them. I wasn't like, I usually don't collect pre-order benefits for, I was gonna say members. Cut to the full Jibon binder. <laughs> but yeah, I wanted to like, I just wanted to, so yeah. This is her very happy one. They're also like, they're official JYP cards. They're not like store benefit cards. So yeah, and they're also really affordable, so. So this is a Japanese card that I'll just be putting on the random page. She's so cute. Oh my God. <laughs> and then this What is Love one, the What is Love pre benefits are so cute. The other one where they all like are eating candy, adorable. So this more and more card I already have, but this Summer Nights one is her Summer Nights pre-order benefit. I think the f like all three of the Summer Nights ones are in this set. These are two Twice Land. This one is. I don't know what this one is from, but these are merch cards, I believe, or concert cards. I'm really not 100%, but it came with the set. The set was really inexpensive, so. I'm just gonna store all of these because they're quite cute. And then these are the Year of Yes ones. I think there's only two. If there's a third one, then there's a third one, but I think there's only two. So as you can tell, my cat just walked on my table, but the last two cards were these Summer Nights ones. So I'm gonna clean this pile up and then yeah, I'll be back. <laughs> okay, next card, the next few cards are actually some Ghost Night cards. So this is Kang Sung's Now. Now. <laughs> I know the album that they did after this was also called Now, but I just call that one up all night and I call this one Now. I don't know. I couldn't ever remember this album's name, but yeah, that Kang Sung card, which I actually pulled and then traded for like Jinwoo, I think. So yeah, now I have that back. And then this is Dong Joon's, uh, their first album. So, yeah. Their first album. Nope. This is Dong Jin's second album, Wall. Yes, the Wall card. Very excited to have this. I'm happy I have him and Taesung completed now. So yeah, just happy about that. <laughs> and then I also have Jin Hyung's Wall card and his storytelling card. So yeah, this is the like bigger story card and then his album card. Yay, love some Ghost Nine. Oh my God, I have another Ghost Nine card. This is a Prince Pruder benefit. I went through a moment where I just found a bunch of Prince Pruder benefits and some other Prince stuff for pretty cheap. And because he's my overall bias in Ghost Nine, um, I decided to pick it up. So yeah, this is one of his Pruder benefits from Up All Night era. So cute. <laughs> this next card. <laughs> I did not need to buy this, but ding. <laughs> card is just so fucking cute. This is the market shop. It's the one where like they're holding little Sanrio stuffed animals and I think it's the cutest. So I have that. Okay, this, I'm gonna be real honest with you. I have absolutely no idea why I got this. <laughs> it's like Yosung pre-order benefit. It's not an MMT. I have no idea where this is from, Um, but I own it. So yeah, <laughs> I don't know why I got that. <laughs> This is Taesung's wall card. A lot of wall cards. Yeah, this is Taesung's wall card. I love this song. It go crazy. And then I have actually another Ghost Nine card. This is Woojin's wall card, which is so cute. Yeah, super cute. Love the jacket. Looks great. Cat hair everywhere. <laughs> 
And then another wall card. <laughs> this is Jensung's wall card. I think I pulled this one too and traded it. So happy to have him back. Very, very cute. Oh my goodness. This is the last Miracle ID card. I'm finishing my uh, Golden Child collection up until Game Changer with this haul too. But this is the last ID card I needed. It's Sungin's ID card. I actually owned this previously as well when I collected him like a year ago, but now we back. I also have another Ghost 9 card. Wow, a lot of these were not in top loaders, but this is Jinsung's now card. I also pulled this along with this Kangsung and then traded them. But like I said, they're back, back in action. So much Ghost 9 in the frame. We love to see it. This is a set of Mina's Feel Special cards. So I actually needed, I believe all four of these. I'm so excited to have these. I am really just over the moon. My toys collection is so much fun, but this is the like flower card. Then we have the member color card, the member, yeah, the member color border card, <laughs> the like black or brown. I don't know what color that is. This color border one, and then the white like music video color border. So yeah, that's that for Mina. And then I have some more Jonghyun pre-order benefit cards. So it is her full fancy pre-order benefit set. One of the most stunning pieces of cardboard on the face of planet Earth. I love these so much. Like they're just so cute. They're kind of weird. Like this one's weird. I don't love the pink, but like these two are adorable. The puppy one. Screaming. <laughs> and then these are some more just Jonghyun merch cards. Um, yeah, I don't really know what they're from. They came with the set and like you can find twice not album stuff for really inexpensive. So I just picked it up because I had the full fancy set, but these little Polaroids are cute. Maybe I'll have like a little Jonghyun Polaroid page. That would be adorable. I might do that. That would be really cute. Another Ghost 9 card. This is Taesung's wall card. Nope. Why do I keep saying literally just the wrong album? <laughs> this is Taesung's now card where he got this crazy vest thing. I don't know what's up with that. Interesting styling choice for sure. <laughs> and then this is... Oh, okay. So this is her hollow. I'm gonna sleeve this back up because I am collecting OT9 for this. So hopefully I can find a trade for it. But this is her twice coaster lead one period of benefit with is that Mina in the background. That's really funny. I really like this card. Like this looks like an album card. Adorable. Okay. And then, okay, this is where the nonsense starts. Never before been seen on this channel, but okay. So this is Yechen from Omega X. Let me just like tell you the saga. So uh, someone recommended me to listen to Omega X on Twitter. So I did. And I was watching the music video for Vamos. And I was like, oh shit, wait a second. I think I know him. Knowing nothing about the group's lore. I loved One the Nine. I loved One the Nine so much. I was pretty devastated when they broke up, but it was like before I had been on YouTube. So I never talked about them because I didn't collect them before my, it was before my collecting era. But when I saw Yechen was in Omega X and I loved their debut mini so much, or it's only like, you know, however many songs it is. I love it so much. Um, so I just started buying some of his cards. This is one of his pure cards or fan sign cards from Jump Up, but yeah, I'm gonna collect a little bit of Yechen, I think. I was just so excited to see him debut again. And, oh my god, I just saw yesterday, or a few days ago, that another one of the members of One the Nine debuted in uh, Just Be. My boys are coming back. I loved One the Nine. <laughs> then we have a Love and Letter Vernon card. Yeah, yeah, I love this card, so. Yay, some more Vernon. Slowly, slowly working on his collection. <laughs> Then I have another Omega X card. This is Ye Chen's showcase card. Cutie little message written on the bag though. Love that. And then, yeah, this is Ye Chen's debut prod, or like the debut showcase card. I really liked this whole set. It's very cute, but just wanted to get Ye Chen's. I can't believe I already filled this up again. Shoop. 
that was very satisfying to do. <laughs> And then I have a bunch of Woods cards. I bought this, I think there's three of them in here. Um, I bought it mainly for Miss Breadstick photo card, one of my favorites. And then I think I have this one already, but I definitely don't have this one. So I'm just gonna put this one with the other cards and then sleeve these two. These are some equal photo cards. Oh, this card is so cute. Breadstick photo card. We love to see it. Okay. This is Dong Jun's now card or Dong Jin's now card. And then, okay, this is my favorite Woojin card. Look at him. It's so cute. The little face heart. This is his wall card, I believe. Door and wall era. We're so great. What a great time for the ghosties. So yeah, my favorite Woojin card is so fucking cute. <laughs> And then I have this Yecheng card. I don't know where this is from, but look at him. Oh my God, it's so cute. Oh, I can't believe he's the youngest member of Omega X because he was like in the middle of one the nine, but there he is, so true. Okay, this, this is a full Make Star set of like Golden Child's Pareto Benefits. This was $8 for the full set, so we love to see it. I don't remember which one of these I have and which ones I don't, so I'm not gonna sleeve these yet just because if I don't need it, I'm not gonna sleeve it, and I don't wanna like sleeve them just to unsleeve them. So I'm gonna set this aside, but I do have this full set of Make Star cards. I'm really excited because I'm trying to click some OT 10 sets. So yeah, for pre-order benefits. This is a set of Jackson cards. I think I had this one. But I bought this thinking I needed both of these cards, but I literally only need this one. So yeah, that was kind of an L on my part. So just need this one. <laughs> okay, and then I have a Yosang MMT card from Fever Pot 1. Yeehaw, finally making some progress on these ones. I think I have all of them at least on the way. So that's nice. Then this is a bunch of whoops cards. So yeah, I need, I don't think I need this one. I think I already pulled this one, but the rest of these, and these are the two of the like first press cards. So yeah, I'm gonna sleeve all of these. This whole look is so cute. This is a set of Mina cards. I don't think it's all yes or yes. It's not, okay, I was correct. Okay, I think I did need all of these. So anyway, we have the, like one of the music video cards from Yes or Yes, and then the Yes corner selfie version card. This one is so cute. Oh, Miss Mina. And then we have the well-known selfie version or selfie version freebie version cards. I don't know if I have this one. I might, but I don't remember. And then the fancy ring pop card. Adorable. This is a Hoshi You Made My Dawn card. Where is this? Oh, down here. Yeah, just a single Hoshi You Made My Dawn card. I think this was like 300 yen, which is why I just bought a single card, but yeah, have that. And then this is another set of equal Sungyun cards. Love Me Harder just came on too. How fitting. <laughs> oh, this one's cute, the little doodle, but yeah, just two more Sungyun cards. <laughs> He has so many cards. Then I have the last slogan card I needed. This is Jackson's slogan card from Arrival. Yeehaw. And then this is Hoshi's, the other in Ode, like poet color card, color back card, words. <laughs> I already had the other one, so just picked up the one I was missing. I have another Yosang MMT card. This is another Fever Part 1 MMT card so stunning his hair looks so good beautiful okay this is the last mark card i needed turn up <laughs> so yeah this is the last mark card i needed i think if i'm not mistaken it's just this present you and me card was the last one i needed so yeah have that done with mark which means i'm done with three full members of got seven crazy <laughs> and then these are both of sungyun's album cards for quantum leap for when he was in X1. Um, yeah, they're so cute. I'm collecting most of his stuff. I wanted to collect all of his X1 cards, 
um, like the fan club cards, the album cards, and then the merch cards. And yeah, just to kind of have a very complete Sun Yoon collection because, uh, do I need to say it again? <laughs> this is a whoops card. Um, and I'm obsessed with it. This was like one of the ones I wanted to hunt down for whoops. Um, cause I think it's so cute. This one and the other one where he's in the bear costume are my faves. I have another love and letter card. This one is for Hoshi though. His earlier era cards are proving a little bit challenging to find. Is this in a dragon shield sleeve? Okay, this is literally the sleeves that I use. That's rocks. I'm just gonna put it back in there then. But yeah, this is one of Hoshi's love and letter cards. Very cute. This is a bunch of day all cards for Game Changer. And it also had his, like this one, the shopping live card in it, but yay. So yeah, I'm just gonna save all of these real quick. This is the shopping live card. Um, adorable. I might try and find tags too, so I can have like my current bias line. My current bias line. My bias line Golden Child changes every era. <laughs> It feels like. <laughs> but my current bias line in Golden Child is uh, they all tag and Jibom. Obvi Jibom. <laughs> I love these cards. This one is so cute. One of my faves. Easy. Okay. And then these are the last two. So I'm gonna clean this up again. Should I stop laying them out? I feel like it's just taking a lot of time. Maybe I'll stop laying them out. <laughs> We're gonna not do that anymore. <laughs> This is very exciting. I have finally some Jacob cards. I finished my boys collection so long ago and then they didn't, this is their first comeback this year, first Korean album comeback this year. So I have some of his cards finally, woohoo. Happy to be collecting my boy again. But yeah, this is, I don't remember the version names, but these are some cards. I think this is kick, the kick version. And I think this is the splash version. And I have absolutely zero clue what this is, what this is from, what version, but it's one of the sunglasses lenticular cards. So yeah, I have these three. And then I have some more game changer cards. This is a set of tag cards, I believe. Yeah, so these are three tag cards for game changer. I really like this outfit. I think he looks really good in it or these, this like leather outfit, but this one's nice too. Yeah, some tag cards. And then the last non top loader item is this set of Donghyun cards. So, yeehaw. These are three Game Changer, Avi Game Changer cards. Um, yeah, really excited to finally be making some progress. Oh, this cutie little thing. That's cute. <laughs> yeah, Game Changer. I am over halfway done, so we take those. <laughs> okay, that was the biggest pile, so hopefully we'll be moving pretty quickly for the rest of this. So first off, I have some more Cobb cards. I'm really excited to be collecting like more Jacob stuff again. I missed, I really missed collecting him, I will say. <laughs> so these are two more thrilling versions, maybe the bang version and maybe the splash version. I'm correct, that would be epic, but <laughs> yeah, just some Jacob cards. Again, so excited to be collecting him again. Okay, this, this fucking card was everything to me. When this, when this card was released, Stan Twitter, Goldenness Twitter had a little bit of a meltdown. Oh, that's my cat, <laughs> I didn't realize he jumped up here. Wow, hi Shaky, do you wanna look at them? Give them a kiss. Um, this is Jibom and Bowman. Obvi, but this unit card is so cute. I am in love with it. There is another unit card for this era that I did pick up um, because of it, how cute it was. So yeah, this Jibom and Bowman unit. We went crazy for that one as we should. <laughs> this is another Jibom card. I don't remember where this is from apologies but yeah just another one of Javon's. i think this is a pre-order benefit i don't think it's a fan sign card also my cat's just gonna lay here he's that's the mood that he's in and i don't want to kill his vibe so he's here <laughs> so yeah this is another Javon card 
And then this is Prince's Tower Records card for now. I really like this card. I don't love all the other Tower Records cards, but this one, round of applause for this card. I think it's so cute. So yeah, this is Prince's Tower Records cards from now era. I finally have Yuno's Wave question mark MMT card. I think it's the Wave one, but yeah, really excited about this. So now my page for Yuno and Yosung for this era is done. Yunsung, if you will. Okay, this next one is also very exciting. Oh my god, the next two are so exciting. Okay. <laughs> this is Jibom's. It was, they did like a promo where if you bought their light stick between like dates, you could, there was like a random photo card that came along with it. And this is from when they shot Gulcha Holiday. And I... Like, to say I was obsessed with Culture Holiday would be, like, a little bit of an understatement. So, I'm so excited to have this. I love this card. I think it's so cute. And then just, like, I really love Culture Holiday. I think they're so funny. It's, like, my favorite variety series to watch. So, yeah, I have this Jibom card. And then, y'all, they did this for me. They did this for me. Yeah. Yup. Day tech unit. Day tech unit. <laughs> Yeah, once again, no idea what store this is from, but my beloved, they look so fucking cute. I love this card. Ugh, when I saw it, I just had to, had to buy, had to buy. These are some more Jacob cards, some more thrilling cards. I think I, this one, I already opened it in this video, but this one, I don't think I did. Okay, yes, I totally did. I already opened this one in the video. So we already have that one, but then these, two yes these three are all ones i needed so yeah bang version splash version question mark so all the splash version cards are in this video i believe <laughs> oh my god equals playing for the third time i'm not listening to that song again i've been filming for this long <laughs> ay 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 okay <laughs> This is Sungyung's X1 Fan Club set. <laughs> oh my god, I completely demolished that. <laughs> nice. <laughs> so yeah, these are his um, X1 Fan Club cards. Super cute. Then I have this Jackson Call My Name card. I pulled this card so many times. So I'm really kicking myself for trading it as many times as I did, but you know, what are you gonna do? <laughs> it's his name tag card. So now I have that guy. More Jacob, more Cobb cards. Cutie, cutie, cutie. Okay, I already have this one, but these three, I need them all. <laughs> I don't think I have every single um, thrilling Jacob card in here, but I have most of them. Yeah, pretty excited about that, so. I really like the backs of these cards too. Oh, this is an MMT card. Hey, MMT card. <laughs> but I really like the backs of the like regular album cards. They're cute. Why did I not know what this was? That's kind of embarrassing, but I do have a Jacob Extras page, so. Love the boys. This is Bowman's first fan club card. Oh, my cat's falling asleep. Oh, cutie, okay baby <laughs> yeah this is bowman's fan club card i sleep these in different sleeves so have that this is one of the last present you and me cards i needed it's j bomb's sleeping card this card is so weird well like i think everyone's supposed to be sleeping he has one eye open <laughs> he's always watching <laughs> but it's this like sleeping set Hard. I don't know, it's very cute, but it's a little strange. <laughs> and then this is a set card. Super cute card. I do love this one. It is so cute. And then this is Jibom's Tower Record set for um, Game Changer. So it has the Polaroid and the just like card. So. Yeah, have both of these. I do like that Tower Records does printed Polaroids. I think they're cute. Yeah, now I have all of his Tower Records cards except for Wannabe era. So that rocks. <laughs> and then this is Yuno's 
the 18 e version of the Dreamers album. I, yeah, really, because I found Yo Songs in that set, I was determined to find this one, and I found it for a pretty decent price. It was under a thousand yen, so we take those. So yeah, you knows Tower Records card, not Tower Records, you knows Dreamers card. Okay. And then the last stuff I have is like packaged irregularly. This came with some Woods stuff. This is his, uh, the key ring from the fan club, I believe. I think this is with the fan club cards set that I got. This was just with it. So yeah, have this little Woods key ring. Cute. And then this was also with some Woods set thing. I don't really remember what item exactly it came with, but Oh, now you want to get up. Now that we ain't doing the photo cards anymore. <laughs> yeah, I think these are just like some fan-made things, but these photos are so cute. Shut up. You're joking. No, you're joking. That's so fucking cute. This is a button, a little pin badge. Okay, cute. A badge for him and Jungyeon both in this video. And then this is a key ring like a little clear key ring thing that just says woods on it very fun oh my cat saw something go get it buddy he sees something <laughs> but this woods key ring and then these two little stickers so this was really cute really excited to have this and then okay this is honestly a very ridiculous purchase so it's the x1 there's a binder and a pouch here the pouch i thought I didn't think it came with any cards, but it's the full set for X1 binder and pouch cards. So I have these now. I'm gonna take out Sungyeon's just cause I know I'm gonna store those ones. I'm gonna throw these back in here for now. I can't imagine there's a lot of X1 collectors out there in 2021, but I'll find something to do with those. You know, they're cute. I'm sure there's someone out there that'll want them at some point in time, so we'll see. But I do have Sungyun's like merch set, so that was all the X1 cards that we've done so far. Okay, final few things. This video is so fucking long. Oh my god. So this is some more Yechen cards. This is his, uh, does this have both of his album cards in it? Or just one of them? I don't know. Okay. So this is the film strip from Vamos album. What is, oh, it's just taped together. Yeah, okay, great. <laughs> so yeah, this is his film strip from Vamos. And then this is one of his album cards. And then this is a Make Star card. Cause you know, Make Star does them hollow cards. So cute. I thought his other album card was in this question mark, but guess not that's fine i really like oh oh <laughs> okay i really like the back of this one i think it's really pretty so yeah some more yachan cards and then uh, <laughs> the final sungin card pre-game changer era she's home it this is from goldenness so it came with his ticket which i think i have already actually which is funny but and then both of his album cards so i have this one already Go in your house, this bitch. Why did this card take so long to find? I've been looking, like even when I collected Sungyun like a year ago, like I said, this card was nowhere to be found, but I have her now. So, ah, oh, golden child's done, up to game changer. Thank God. <laughs> and then the final item I have, this one I'm really excited about. I'm not gonna take it out of the packaging cause I think I'm just gonna store it in the packaging it came with. But I bought this um, like very randomly one night. It was very inexpensive, but it's a signed postcard from Tower Records, I believe, of Prince from Ghost Nine, one of my favorite groups. So yeah, really excited to have this. I'm just gonna leave it in the packaging, but. Okay, that was all for this monster haul. Thank you all so much for making it all the way through this video. If you watched it to this point, I really appreciate it. Um, and yeah, I'm gonna go drink some tea because I've been talking for so long, my throat's kind of scratchy. So yeah, I'll see you all next time. And my cat says bye too. Shaky, can you say bye? Oh my God, look at him. He said, no, I'm going to bed. Okay, bye. Mm -hmm.